What's going on guys, No Galea here, and today we're back with another episode of Final Fantasy VII Remake. In the last episode, this is self-explanatory what happened last episode. I'm I'm just ready to get past this. <laughs> this is ridiculous. So yesterday I had asked about the lighting, and I didn't know if uh, this is too dark or maybe I need some kind of light behind me. You can check in my Tekken video if the light the is too much. The two of you here for the audition? Second floor, at the very end of the walk. And don't go poking your nose in where it doesn't belong. Perfect. Uh, it says that we could talk to him again, so let's... Room's on the second floor, at the very end of the walk. Alright, cool. Make sure there ain't no, uh... No shit over here. Alright. But yeah, last episode was... That was Madame M's girl, ain't Quite an episode. Bitch. What's good? Was We've it Blade? Been waiting for you to show. Damn. Hey, hands to yourself. Oh shit. Fuck it. That Andreas girl? I'd let her do things to me. I kill you. Absolutely murder you. Decapitation. Rooms at the end. Keep walking. All right, bro. I'm low-key worried to see what's behind this damn door. Oh, but as I was saying, uh, I'd like to get some feedback on like what you guys think on the light and should I use background light or not. Or this is cool. What's that weird, sweet smell? Oh, you about to knock us Why out. Why do I feel so dizzy? Gas. Come on. She's gonna pass out. Damn it. Cloud. Damn. <laughs> Didn't we fight dude in the Coliseum? Let's <laughs> maybe escort you to the parlor. Without subtitles, I would not understand a damn thing he just said to me. Oh shit. Can you hear me? Oh. Tifa? Yes. You okay? Mm-hmm. <laughs> Good. Can't do anything but laugh, Wait bro. This a minute. <gasps> Cloud? Is that you? Oh my god, that makeup and that dress. Took you a minute. Nailed it. I know, thank you. Moving on. <laughs> <laughs> you said nailed it. You good? Yeah, bit woozy, but I'll manage. <sighs> hey Tifa, how you doing? Uh, okay. Oh, right. I'm Aerith, a friend of Cloud's. We were worried and thought we'd come help you out. Uh, thanks? Cut the chatter. We gotta leave. Huh? Right now. Uh, no, not until I got what I came for. What? And what's that? So. After we made it back to the slums, some guys came around asking all kinds of questions. So I did some digging. And found out they were Corneo's men. Right. They were interested in Avalanche. But I couldn't figure out why. So I thought I'd come and ask the man himself. Seriously? Thought if I could find a way in and get some one-on-one -on -one time. But then I realized I'd only be one of three candidates. And that if he didn't pick me, it would all be for nothing. Then your worries are over, aren't they? Because the other two candidates are right here, right? Uh, right. So yeah, if we're all in on it, then nothing can go wrong. Uh, I guess not. You? Me? Cloud? It makes no difference who gets chosen, does it? I don't know, Aerith. It feels wrong getting you involved in all this. Don't even bother trying to talk her out of it. She won't Aww. listen. Oh, Cloud get 
hurts me. Took you long enough. Join the party. There we go. We got a team so of three now. now. I think they'll call for us when it's time. This room gives me the creeps. This is a creepy ass place. What we got over here? Some bullshit. Let's see what we can find in here. Oh, you already know how I got how I get down with the music. Let's kick this shit over. Is this the dude? God. Okay. He's ugly. But you know we gotta do what we gotta do. We're gonna go ahead and take this song real quick. Might as well get some mega potions. How much? Uh, we're good on Gil. Let's go ahead and get out of here real quick. I don't want to spend too, too long in here. Now, ladies, listen up. I'm sure you're still feeling a bit woozy, but tonight's audition's about to begin. Head out the door to the left and up the stairs. Come on, ladies. Let's hustle. What is he going to make us do? This shit is ridiculous. All right, guys. Let's do this. Do you want to do this? No. See, y'all think this shit funny. No, I guess I can't go there, but... What do you guys think of the series so far, if you're a returning viewer? <laughs> so far, like I've said before, I'm enjoying the series. Um, I said in my last episode that... I will have a Instagram... Pretty much, like, for different polls and votes on games I should play on the channel along with this one and uh, the Tekken series that I got so definitely hit that up I'll try to post on there uh, coming soon okay my beautiful ladies time to line up for the dawn <sighs> well you look kind of familiar we haven't met before, have we? Nope. Mm -mm. Uh, whatever. All right, y'all good to go? Catch is this his thing. name. Introducing Walmart's most eligible bachelor, the one and only Don Corneo. Lady. Don't touch, don't touch the titty. <laughs> Whichever one shall I pick? This looks like dude from Street Fighter. Is it oh. Abigail? Shall I pick you? <laughs> Abigail from Street or Fighter. maybe you? Yeah. <laughs> don't tell me that. Is this gonna be the jackpot? Uh, out of the three, oh, yeah. out of the three, I've who are you it. picking? I've got it. I think I'm. Today's right to me is. Today's. I think Tomorrow, I would go Aerith personally. Happens, if the Don takes a shine to you. Pathetic. Huh? Hey, which one of you said that? It was me, my guy. What was you gonna do? You? Got a mouth on you. I'm gonna enjoy breaking it in. Today's Man. lucky lady is the big bone girl. <laughs> Rip his Still arm. Still playing off. hard to get? I can dig it. Oh yeah. <laughs> the leftovers are all yours. What? <laughs> okay, ladies. Y'all come with me. Don't be shy, little kitten. Shimmy on over and give daddy some sugar. No need to play coy. Nobody here but you and me. Oh, this dude. You're even cuter than I thought. Back off. Woo! <laughs> this kitten's got claws. I love it. <laughs> Look at his stomach. What was that? Don't you worry, your pretty little head. Just a picture to preserve the moment. And to ensure you don't do anything inappropriate, like say no. Asshole. There we go. 
praise me more. <laughs> this dude is a freak. Hey, yo, fellas. We got guests. And y'all got first crack at entertaining them. Oh, we're gonna whoop some ass. Courtesy I can hear the music now. Generous Don Corneo himself. Never forget the Don provides. Yeah. Good day. Let's, let's handle this real quick. So I think I choose Aerith out of the three. Ready to I don't know. Her eyes just. Yeah. I guess I'm good to go whenever. How about you, Tifa? Which one are you guys choosing down below? Cloud, okay. Tifa, or Eric? Right. <laughs> Wait. Cloud is an option. I know you. The Coliseum. <laughs> Ooh. Oh, we don't get the plan? Mm. Damn, bro, your your form, your form was at. She got the steel chair. Damn. I love it. Oh, this quick little, you know. It was nothing compared to you. <laughs> oh, yeah. She whooped the ass. She had to steal a chair on him. Now we got to whoop Kingdom Hearts ass. Andrea filled me in on the situation. I come bearing gifts with you. I'll do what I can to clean this up. Just finish the job. All right. So Kingdom Hearts kind of cool. Oh, thank you. Cause I forgot his name. Oh yeah. Oh okay, shit, we get to. Oh, I, th I thought we were uh, controlling Tifa low key. So what we got around here? I know we gotta we gotta help the boy Cloud out, but in the words of Berlizzi, I wouldn't be me if I didn't loot. Let's get the fuck up out of here. Leslie, okay, so that's the same. Oh, he's just gonna say the same thing. Cool. So. Yeah, I'd love to spend some quality time because like that. Bet they're going at it right now. I thought that man had the Draco or Uzi. All right, let's uh, let's get on down real quick. Let's see. Knock it out. Damn, he got the big sniper rifle. What are you doing here? You've got this. I like Tifa's fighting style, yo. It just, oh shit, just a straightforward whoop ass fighting style. The sword you can too. He just power up. We're about to see how terrible I am at um. Ah oh, yes, let's go. Dive kick. Come on, let's do it again. Here goes. Let's go ahead and do this. One more shot. That wasn't so bad. Okay, so she keeps it in like her jacket. I've always wondered where she kept that damn staff or pole, whatever the damn shit's called. But Tifa's fighting style reminds me of uh, Final Fantasy Dissidia, like a lot. Which I guess most of these characters really could, but. <laughs> Don't stop, tell me what you a bad boy I bastard. am! <laughs> yes, yes I am! Here I come, baby! <laughs> right in his chest. Yeah. Hey! Who the hell gave you permission to do that? One of you get in here and teach this bitch some manners! Oh man, he ain't got no respect. Sorry, but your boys had to learn some manners too. Yes. What the? Cloud, your clothes. <laughs> Please, hold up. Oh. Hey, hey, yo, chill. <gasps> so you're a man, huh? Yes. What are you three up to? We'll ask the questions. Like, why'd you have men in Sector 7 asking about Avalanche? Man. Huh? I don't think I got my right don't sword on. Don't play dumb with me. Let's try again. Give him a good... Yep. Why did you have men in Sector 7 
Asking I was gonna say give him a gut avalanche. check, but spill the beans or I'll cut him off. Ooh. All right, all right, I'll talk, I'll talk. <sighs> That's what I'm talking about. Cloud intimidating the fuck out of this dude. Uh, some guy with a gun for an arm. I was paid to find him. Paid by who? I can't tell you that. They'd hunt me down like a dog. Well, you better. Cause if you don't, she's got some nice eyes I'll too, though. Rip them off. <laughs> it was the director of public security, Heidegger. It was Heidegger. Shinra. And what were they planning? Some things are better left unsaid, you know. Oh, see, I'm not so sure they are. Better keep talking, or I'll smash them. Cut him, tear him, smash him. He might like that though. He freaked nasty. <laughs> All right, you got me. I could never say no to a sexy girl. Since Avalanche blew up two reactors, Shinra's decided they ought to stamp them out, home base and all. And I mean, stamp out. By targeting the support pillar and blowing it up. The pillar? Did I stutter? The plate will come crushing down. <laughs> It'll be Sector 6 all over again. I'm sure you've been there and seen the wreckage for yourself. So you know exactly what Sector 7 is going to look like. They wouldn't. Go ahead and uppercut him. Come on, guys. Him. We gotta go. Because he going to snitch. Before you do. No. Please, this won't take long. Unless you want to fight. As everyone knows, villains only divulge their plans in a certain situation. Oh. But what is that situation? They got the upper hand or some shit. When they think they've won, right? When they think they've already won, right? Ladies and gentlemen, we have ourselves a winner. Yeah, I watched a couple of animes to know that. Ah. <laughs> Enjoy the sights and smells. <laughs> what an ass. We're going to go ahead and get a trophy or what? Well, there we go. <laughs> that was delayed. Are we on the schedule? Yeah. <laughs> The Turks are on top of it. Yes, there will be no delays. Please, Mr. President, I am asking you to reconsider. Please. No begging. The Sector 7 Undercity is home to more than 50,000. <sighs> Director Twisty. At least let us issue a warning, sir. The stench of the director's cowardice fills the room yet again. <clears throat> we got a big Progress boss and uh, sacrifice. solid snake. I think that's how it goes. Learn to live with it. Now they might both be big boss. And Metal Gear Solid three big boss, and then I don't know where the Heidegger dude would be. So the rough waters chapter. So, whoop some ass, ain't we? Damn it, Reeks. I bet. I'm gonna go ahead and change our sword back, and I'll be right back. Alright, so. We're back to us. Go ahead and wake up Aerith and Tifa real quick. Aerith. Uh, cloud. 
We have to get to Sector 7. We have to. Yeah. Freak nasty. Alright, so I noticed something about the proficiency and I'm something I'm somebody that looks past looks past certain things at certain points. And um I know it's the more you use a certain weapon, do you learn that skill permanently? Oh shit. Let's get out of there. He flexing on us? Alright, so Damn, that did a lot of damage. Alright, cool. So, what I mean by that, like, I could do this. Oh, shit. Or that. Not that, but this move right here. If I get proficiency 100 with other weapons, uh, could I put the other skills in that slot? Oh, shit. Get off air. Get off air. Get off air. Damn. Alright, so let's use Braver real quick. Or just get fucked. We're gonna go ahead and use this. Um... No, wait. I want her to heal. Okay. Potencies. Cool. We're gonna use a mega on cloud. But we are about to die. And then I'll return the favor. Oh, so I asked this uh, question in my earlier videos. What do you guys think of the, the style change? Like, do you guys like this form of uh, Final Fantasy? Or do you guys like the more turn based, you know, the original style? Let's switch it up. I got Tifa. Good luck. Need to heal up. Here goes. Let's get some of the range attack scenes. Oh shit. All right, so can you take over for me? Cloud can actually summon. So let's go ahead and do that real quick. Cause I think his summon is a little bit better. Is it uh, E three? You're up. This thing does some damage. Mm. I don't know if y'all remember that show, uh, Chaotic, but that's what that monster reminds me of. Or the summon reminds me of. Alright, so yeah. weakness is fire. It actually reminds me I want to do something real quick. Or just get hit by that. Um, I thought she had a healing ability. Oh, okay. Cool. Alright, so I need to use Assess real quick. Because Allow me. information is perfect. A giant beast that Don Canero keeps in the sewers. Okay. Much more intelligent than it appears, right? But I did not read all that. We're gonna have Tifa heal us, man. This, this is some thing. I'll show you what I can do. All right, cool. This one's for you. Oh shit! Tagging out. Whip his ass! Whip his ass! All right, so we're gonna use a summon ability. We're gonna use Crimson Dog real quick. And then we're gonna have Tifa use a uh, Radiant Plume, which. Cool. Ah, oh, he jumped in the water. We're gonna have uh, Aerith do a summon ability too. Uh, 
Oh, is he about to leave? No, he's about to do it. Hurt. Let's keep that pressure up. Oh yeah, he's about to do that that big mode damage. Beast mode. This shit is amazing. Mmm. I'll pay you back. He said he'll pay him back. Alright, so this is the pause in the fight. He's about to be pissed. Okay, this is where we switch to Eric. We just keep hitting him with these long range. Whoa, whoa, whoa. See, that AOE shit low key be on that bush. Yet. Come on, let's get hers up real quick and then have her use Prag. Do you guys like, um. Please. Do you guys like the longer episodes for, um. For Final Fantasy, or do you like me to keep them short? This one's for you. Oh shit! Got to use a phoenix now. Okay, up and at him. You're still doing Don't okay, go. right? Of all the times. Goodness, goodness, we have to. All right. Um, she's on cloud. So I apologize for that, um, that little skip I had to do just now. Wait, where's my cure? I can still fight. Yeah. Sure, however I can help. This some bullshit. What happened to the cure? I literally... <laughs> the fuck? Alright, let's use it on cloud. Pick him up. Out of the. Cause we need to be able to use prey again. Should have been there. Oh fuck. We'll get him to the halfway mark if we die. I gotta use a phoenix now, man. I hate getting to this point. We need to revive Aerith. I don't know where to hide. Just uh, I can't believe you. That's it. I'm this just... one's for you. What's he doing, bro? <sighs> okay. 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 We'll come back when he's back at the halfway mark. Tifa. We have to get back to the slums right now. Yeah. I didn't want to drag Aerith into all this. She'll understand. How do you two know each other? I saved her. She saved me. Round and round it goes. I'm gonna add this part just to have both uh, views of it. That's all there is to it. Sure, there isn't something else going on. Mm. I thought it'd be a generic just like same thing but no it was actually more dialogue talking to Tifa and then Alright y'all, he's back to have health. <clears throat> and kinda of figured out his rhythm. He attacks Oh no 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 wait, this is a different attack. Oh shit. Can we block it if we stand close to this? Perfect. And then we just get free um One more shot! ATB off of that. Why don't so we're gonna you switch to Tifa because she's the only one that doesn't have any limit. And I saved a summon for for the second round this time. Have fun. He's not gonna have fun. He's about to get beasted on. Alright. 
Uh, let's see, let's see. And then, I'm gonna control Cloud real quick. I was gonna control Cloud real quick. Oh, that makes him... Damn. That makes the summon go ahead and happen. Oh, uh, let's see. Phoenix down, of course, using on Cloud. And then she can use another. We'll use a Mega on Cloud. Perfect. All right, so he jumped in the water. So it's my turn. We're gonna switch to Cloud, and we're gonna have him do his limit break. Cross slash real quick. Any last words? Mm. It just takes maximum damage. And then Aerith's special ability heals everybody, right? Uh, let's actually use Refocus. So that way everybody has a uh, really fast. One more shot. Shit. It's on you. I got this. She has the most health. She can take this. No way. It's that attack. We good. We good. Or I could have blocked. I gotta focus on, I gotta pay attention to my defense too. All right. Let's use some dive kicks. Ow. Oh shit. Wow, in slow motion. Uh, let's use prey. Is this Dark Souls? Like, you just attack me while I'm doing my shit. Um, it's actually Cloud that can revive her real quick. We'll do that. Be careful. And then we'll do, uh, since he's got another one, we'll use High Potion on Tifa. That's it! Stop it! Can you handle you already know what to do. He attacks whoever you're playing. Like all of them. Uh, we get out of the way of the fight, right? Never mind. Alright. I forget I can just hold square. And then we're gonna have, uh. We're gonna have her do healing wind this time. Cause we are. Come on, you ain't gotta do that. Okay, perfect. Do a dive kick. Let's play Cloud. Okay, I about to say we gotta get in his ass. And then Tifa has her uh, limit break now. Let's do it. Perfect. It just take a little strategizing sometimes. You gotta look at it um, as more than just a button mash or hack and slash. And I had a little, I had a little snack on the off camera, Tom. There so it goes. That, just whoop your ass and you gonna dip. Do you think it lives down here, or...? It was probably Corneo's pet. When we were dinner. <laughs> hey, you don't believe that crazy story of his, right. do you? I think I've seen that laugh before. Shinra wouldn't sacrifice a whole sector just to take out Avalanche, would they? Destroying part of the city? Killing all those people just to get at us? I don't know. Is Corneo the kind of guy who'd make up shit just to screw with you? I wouldn't put it past him. But if he was telling the truth, hmm? and there's still a chance he was, isn't there, then we should go. And if it turns out he was lying, then so what? Right? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, Tifa! Alright. I knew it. These tunnels are all connected. What is it? I'm pretty sure we can use these tunnels to make our way back to Sector 7. 
The sewers under Sector 6 and 7 should be connected. If you get in trouble, just follow the stench. Another one of those lessons? An avalanche saying, actually. We use them to move around the Undercity, in emergencies. Sure we're not lost? Perfect. Positive. There should be a big waterway just up ahead. Let's find that place. Now we gotta go back here. Let's go ahead and check this real quick. Alright, so it seems that we're gonna do a lot of walking, so I'm gonna do more of that, uh... Eh, let's see. Gotta, you gotta have a looting aspect of you. Pair of feathered gloves. That's probably for Tifa. I'm gonna. It's really dark. I'm sure we'll be fine. Come on. Hey, Cloud. Assuming Corneo was telling us the truth, what do you think Shinra's really up to? I mean, they've gotta have an endgame. But I can't imagine what it is. Destroying a whole chunk of the city okay. just to get back at us doesn't make any kind of sense. I don't know how they're gonna yeah. do it. I can't imagine any way they could profit from it. It's gonna cost them a fortune to rebuild. Corneo's lying. He's gotta be. The guys like him do it all the time out of habit. He might be. We gotta save our home. I'm just assuming the other way is essentially the same shit. What is this though? Hmm. Okay. That's a power generator, all right. Wow. Talk about ancient. It's an antique. Older than the Mako reactors, even. It'd be a miracle if it still works. Now we gotta try it right after we hit the box. <laughs> Alright, let's see. So we actually did get something out of it. Key to the sewers. Hmm. Maybe it goes to that door. I'm gonna go check real fast. And I'll be right back. Alright, so that key didn't have anything to do with that uh gold and red door. It had something to do with this. Damn, Aerith is ready. Let's see. Wait a minute. I know this place. Sector 7 should be just on the other side of this waterway. So this is where Sector 6 ends. And where Sector 7 begins. Once we cross over, we can start looking for a way back to the surface. Might be harder than you think. Let's just try to make our way down this tunnel. See if we can't use those gates to clear a path. We can do this. We'll figure it out. Yeah, for sure. Alright, well, I feel like that's a good way to end the episode. Um, if you enjoy, please leave a like and subscribe as always. And, um, of course, my dog wants to interrupt the outro. But, if you enjoy, please leave a like and subscribe. And as always, y'all have a good one.